Hi, I'm Harry. I'm uh, working with the team at Supporter, and today I've been given this uh, tandem paddleboard by Aquamarina to try out and have a look at whether or not a couple should should get a tandem paddleboard instead of two single boards. Um, I'm in the middle of pumping it up on my own, which is quite hard work because Nick's gone off. My wife's just gone off to walk the dog, and uh, so because we're going to take the dog on it with us, so she's not too hyper when when we're trying to go to a beach but yeah plan for today is head board out find a really quiet beach to go to and um yeah have a bit of a picnic and then come back and try try out the board as much as possible yeah there's nick and the dog come on Lou. come on come on Lou. good girl <laughs> that's a good dog out just in time just in time to help me pump up the rest of it Just trying to get it up to 18 psi and uh, show us your pumping skills, Nick. <laughs> She's not it's not heavy enough. <laughs> hey, <touch. laughs> I think we're about there, though. <laughs> <laughs> First leg of our trip on the tandem board. Um, really impressed with it so far. It's pretty easy to, it's fairly stable. With two of you standing up, probably need a bit of practice. Um, but what's really great about it is that we're both together paddling at the same speed, which is really good. So if you've got two people paddling at different speeds, or one person needs to look after the dog or something, it's pretty cool. Or kids or whatever, it means you can stay together. And. Uh, yeah, first impressions, I really like it. So you can fit quite a lot on this board, which is one of the really nice things. We haven't got too much on it at the minute, but we've got two of our pannier racks full of our lunch and towels and beach stuff. And obviously with the dog as well. Um, yeah. There's a lot you can a lot you can fit on this really it'd be really good for touring. Come to our secluded beach. This is where we're going to chill out for the day. This is social distancing at its finest. The only way you can get him here is by paddleboard or kayak, I guess. Um, and yeah, I really like the paddleboard because it means that Nick can do all the hard work whilst I fly the drone. <laughs> Accurate perception. <laughs> So I used to work at a water spot shop and we, it was kind of before paddleboarding took off and we always sold loads of sit on top kayaks which is kind of like a similar market space to these things and I reckon probably one in one in three or one in four of the kayaks we sold were, were tandems um, and you just don't see that many paddleboarding tandem boards out there so 
uh, it makes sense. It really does make sense to do it. I was really skeptical at first. I thought oh, it's going to be a bit rubbish, but actually, it's really nice. Um, if you if you're always going to be paddling with with someone else, with your partner or family or whatever, um, I, I think so far I'd recommend it. Yeah, the only negative is, is it is a bit harder to pump, pump up. Yeah. So what what do you think of the board so far, Nick? Yeah, I like it. It's a lot easier to paddle from the back than it is from the front. Um, but it's really nice. It's nice to have two people on it. It's really good for the dog. Loads of storage, very stable. Yeah, it's good. So one of the things to try out is just to see how easy it is to paddle it on your own. Um, so I'm just going to take it out now for a quick paddle around the rocks and back. paddling it on your own it's still pretty maneuverable I think it would be hard if you were um, if it was a bit windier but it's pretty good especially if you're slightly heavier I think it'd be perfect it's really stable um, yeah I thought it's gonna be a bit unmanageable being so big but really it's not too different to my touring board that I've got so yeah you can do it on your own too so we've had our picnic on the beach and uh, I'm gonna head back take a nice scenic route back through the rocks and uh, we're going to try it out a different way around. I'm going to go on the front. Nick's going on the back this time. Uh, I think it's a bit more unstable on the front, maybe. Yeah. But that's what you reckon. So we're going to uh, swap and see what happens. Lady's got her life jacket back on. tandem paddleboard if you're thinking about it. That was, that was really good fun. I really enjoyed using that. It's nice you can, um, I don't know, it's just nice being, staying together on it. Obviously not if you have to social distance from other people. <laughs> but it's, I think it'll take a little while to get used to getting to stay balancing with two of you standing up. But once you get it, I reckon it was, it was really good fun. I really enjoyed that. Great day out. <laughs> 